What is cracking, everybody? How are you all doing? It's April 26, 2023 in beautiful Big Bear, California, and I am going to take you guys on a little look at the dam. We're going to try to get behind it. It's pretty dangerous. I tried yesterday, but I had my phone and I didn't want to have any hands uh, uh, not free from being able to try and hold on while I'm climbing down. So let's see if we can do it okay. Anyway, here's where we're at. Real quick, once again, you guys can always screenshot this stuff. A little Big Bear history here. So screenshot it, and first of all, we're just gonna go down and check out. For those of you who come up here often, look at how high the water is, it's just amazing. I've never seen it this high. We're jumping off those that, that part of the dam, even though it's totally illegal, you'll get in huge trouble, but I'm just saying, compared to how it used to look, it used to look like you would really hurt yourself if you attempted it. But yeah, look at this, this is great, you guys. Absolutely amazing. So we're gonna be crossing the road right now to go over there, but this is the dam. This is the start of the lake here. And we go out there. This is the first time I haven't been able to see the old dam, which they didn't tear it down. It's still standing, but it's underneath all this water. But yeah, let's go check it out. And I wanted you guys to see how much water flows out of this lake every second of every day. It's pretty incredible that our lake wasn't even lower than it was. I'm really nervous about this right now, you guys. I don't want to be one of those YouTubers who tried to tried to get a good shot but didn't work. I almost tripped right there. I'm not even over here yet. All right, and I'm gonna. I have my GoPro thing on, so I'm gonna attach the GoPro to this once we start climbing down. And then I noticed a waterfall about two blocks back. A good waterfall, couldn't believe it. Okay. So this is where we're going back here. And it has really, oh my gosh. I mean guys, that's, I don't know if I can make it back there. I don't, I, I really think this will be too dangerous. Let's see. I hope this ground doesn't give out from under me. I'm sure there haven't been really anybody going back here since all the rain. This is not good. Let's see how stable this is. I don't know if that's gonna hold me. I think we're gonna give it a shot. Oh my gosh. Hang on guys. I gotta put my GoPro on. And then be extra, extra, extra careful. My wife is so worried right now. She's actually down for our son's 20th birthday. Yep, 20th. That is correct. All right, guys. This really is not smart, Nick. What are you doing, dude? Is this pipe, will this pipe hold me? Probably not. Shut up, phone. I can't believe I'm doing this. This is way worse shape than I've ever seen it back here. I am tripping a little bit. Okay, let's see here. Let's get this up a little bit. Make sure these big boulders aren't gonna fall out from under me. Oh my God, I'm such an idiot. Ugh. And look at these 
people right here. God, man. All right, there's a lot of water coming down in here. We just got to be extra careful walking down this bad boy. All right, hang on, we're going to jump off this. Ah. Okay. Well, this is where we're at. It's a little stream coming down here, so we'll go check that out. Oh, jeez. Ah. Look at this little waterfall. We can't get too close to the edge. But we're going to. I don't know if you guys can hear how raging that that water down there is this is a magnificent spot I don't know what I'm doing. Someone died right across there. They tried to jump across that that gap and they slipped and fell right in between and, and they fell all the way down. There's so much erosion happening right here. All right, we're gonna keep on going. I'm hoping to get a better view of what it looks like down there for you all. Oh, geez. So I'm not getting the view that I thought I would get from over here. I'll tell you what. If you guys look down there, I don't know how to zoom in with my GoPro. So I'll keep it focused here for a minute. If you guys zoom in there, You can see white water rapids coming out of the dam. And guys, that's a 24 hour, seven day a week, 365 day a year flow. That's because Redlands owns the rights to our water. So all this water goes down in a river, down to the Redlands area. But yeah, I'm not gonna be going any further down I just feel bad things happening, but so you'll see that patch of snow right there. There's a big rock just above it, just past that big rock. You, you can see some of the heavy flow of water coming out of the lake. It's not good. Our lake would be full <laughs> for sure. Always. If we didn't have to do that, even during droughts, I, I believe we would have a way to keep it full. Let's uh, not fall here. There we go. Maybe I could slide down here. I don't know. I'm 
I'm a little bit too haired. It's way too steep. But yeah, I'm gonna get this camera up a little bit. There we go. So where we come down from. So we're gonna go back up to the top. As I said, you guys, super dangerous. The ground is really unstable right now. Like really unstable. I'm worried. I'm worried about uh, parts of the earth coming apart. Oh. Stand right over this thing. And it, you know what's horrible about this flow is none of this is going into our lake. This is all free water for Redlands. Over this bad boy. It's a little tricky over here. One false move right here, you're in trouble. Look, you, you can kind of see that big pool of water down there, right next to the house on the left hand side. As I said, zoom in if you guys can. I don't know how to zoom in with my GoPro. And then if you look right underneath that arch, at the very bottom, there's a ton of water flowing out. A ton of water. Just listen to how loud the water is. I'll shut up just so we can listen for a good minute or two, okay? I promise you, I'll shut up.
All right, you guys. We're gonna go back up and uh, and across. I am not excited about grabbing that ladder. Look at how nasty this thing is that I have to climb through. This kind of makes me feel like that movie Stand By Me. When the night has come and the land is gone and the mountain crumble to the sea. Hope you guys enjoyed that. So what I'm talking about, all this earth has moved during these storms. And so I'm worried that any step I take, any move I make, God will be watching me then. Oh God, this ladder is just terrifying. Oh, one more step, please, please. Yes, 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 I made it. So yeah, so this is where we're at. That's how you get back there. I don't suggest anyone does. That would not be a good thing. Because I don't want to be responsible for anybody getting hurt. I just figured a good way to get some good views, guys, from above. I am such an idiot. Look at this waterfall, though. Look at it start way up there. And it splits into like three different waterfalls right down here. Beautiful. I want to take the GoPro mount thing off my chest and hopefully it doesn't fall off when I hold it. Oh my gosh, that is scary looking down there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I might get have a heart attack. Look at that guys, that's just horrifying. So we're trying to get where you can see a lot more of the flow out of the lake. Oh, I'd hate to be in an earthquake right here. I never think about it driving over, but my gosh. Oh, I'm like shaking. I swear guys, I'm shaking. Oh my God. Okay, look, that's all the water leaving the lake, you guys. It's a lot of water. I mean, it's a ton of water. Guys, that's a permanent flow. And sometimes they let it out even heavier. But you can hear it raging from all the way up here. It's horrible. just flows all the way down the mountain. Pretty crazy stuff. All right, so we're gonna cross the street and see what we got going on this side. I never really thought about getting the views from on, on top of the lake here, or on top of the bridge. What a smart idea. Any simpleton would have figured that out, but me, no, not me. Oh, we might be able to get a killer view of the water flowing out from right up here. 
Okay, we do. It's not gonna look like, it doesn't look like that much, you guys. But it really is a lot. It's a constant, a constant, constant flow. You saw how much water is in that stream down ahead, right? It's constant. So that's where we just were over there. Looks like we got some leaks in the dam over there. See that? It's not good. But look at this incredible view. Man, pretty spectacular. Head back. remember I think this dam don't quote me on it but I think it was like less than a million bucks when they built it and it was an engineering marvel at the time beautiful I'd love to be able to walk on top of that. That would be nice. I know a bunch of people now. Maybe I could ask someone from the city to let me come with them sometime. I'll fill out whatever waivers are necessary. Then I don't know if you guys can see, but up top, up there, that's the dam keeper's house. They've restored that. Well, I'm sorry, they haven't restored it, they just, uh, They've stopped it from being fully demolished. I don't know if you guys can tell. All right, guys. Take one more look at the beautiful lake from right here. It's gorgeous. So much water, you guys. It's so great. It's literally almost up to the top of the dam. That is fantastic. Well, anyway, thank you guys for cruising. I appreciate it. If, if I can get up to the dam keeper's house right now, we'll take a drive up there, okay? All right. If not, please like and subscribe and share these videos. Please help me out. I would appreciate it. Um, I'm the original Big Bear Weather Guy for a long time. Don't fall for imposters out there. I'm the OG. Come back and see me, please, always. I love doing these videos for you guys. Thank you very much. And take care. All right, guys, we can't drive up here. But we're going to walk up here to the dam keeper's house you guys are going to find this funny but this is the first time i've ever been here i used to fly my drone up here I'll show you guys videos doing that but i had to take down my drone videos so i wouldn't get in trouble from the faa I didn't realize I was doing anything wrong, so. But it was a mea culpa. Let 
there's coyote poops everywhere up here. A coyote got my dog this morning, you guys. Bit his foot. But thank God, we ran outside screaming. The same dog that was lost for a couple weeks, or for a week. This was the dam keeper's house. Uh, yeah, we can do that. I just don't want to get too far from what I from safety. <laughs> you just never know up here. Yeah, we'll go up to the dam keeper's window in this part and just take a look at you. Yeah, this place has been saved from complete demolition. It's a historical landmark now. It'd be nice if they would fix it up and make it into some sort of a tourist attraction or more of a tourist attraction than it is now. guys you gotta be careful going down here so many kooks just kept them up here and litter it's so frustrating I think next time we swing up here, we're gonna bring a bag and just, just spend 10 or 15 minutes to grab what we can. We could have definitely made it up there, but they don't want you driving up this hill, so we're not gonna do it. Well, anyway, <laughs> April 26, 2023, like and subscribe, help me out, I'd appreciate it. Have a good rest of your day, guys. Peace out.